Former President Bill Clinton made two stops in the upstate today. He's stumping for his wife, Hillary. Family members and celebrities are stepping up this season for all the candidates this year. 7 News reporter Rochelle Spence finds out if this is having any impact on the voters. Former President Bill Clinton took the stage for wife Hillary at USC Upstate Thursday. The crowd didn't seem disappointed he was speaking on her behalf. In fact, some say it makes it even more exciting. To be honest, it might be a little bit more exciting to see Bill Clinton since he was the president and she's running. Cameras were up capturing pictures. I took a million, <laughs> at least a million. But I couldn't get a selfie of me and Bill. But that's okay. There'll be other opportunities. Former Governor Jeb Bush tried the same thing out on the campaign trail before dropping out, bringing loved family members like his mother Barbara and brother, former President George W. Bush. His family is key. In life, in my opinion, it's really cool that you get to have your family come and talk about you. Because anyone can talk about itself, but it gives you a little more insight to them. Hillary believes that America never stopped being great. We got to make America whole again, so everybody can see themselves in that picture. Democratic rival Bernie Sanders has someone doing his stumping in South Carolina as well. Rapper Killer Mike. There's only one candidate. Rally goers admit they're looking for more than just information. Oh, it's a celebrity thing, too. I love Bill. To be honest, it was a little bit of a celebrity, like, oh, let me go meet the president, you know what I'm saying? But it was interesting for sure. It's a technique we'll likely see all the way to November. In Spartanburg, Rochelle Spence, 7 News. We spoke with several people at the rally who say they're voting for Hillary Clinton, but they've only attended rallies held by her husband Bill and her daughter Chelsea. They say the family stumping actually means more to them. All the rallying is leading up to Saturday's Democratic primary and all the voting in South Carolina. Of course, we will bring you full coverage this